This is a review for the movie Whiteout, which stars Kate Beckinsale, and the movie takes place in Antarctica. At the beginning of the movie, it takes place in the 1950s, and there's this cargo plane that's being flown by all of these Russians, and on board this plane, they're carrying a lot of dangerous material. Not only that, they're carrying a lot of priceless jewelry, diamonds, gold, stuff like that. So a fight breaks out in the cargo plane, and the plane crash lands, killing the crew instantly. And it lands in the middle of Antarctica, and, it, and the crew is never heard from again. Flash forward about 50 years later, there's this giant scientific base that's in the middle of Antarctica. And the sheriff, played by Kate Beckinsale, comes to the base because she made a lot of mistakes while she was on duty and now she's sort of on probation, so she goes to this base. To make a long story short, a lot of strange things start to happen at the scientific base. Not only are there a lot of brutal snowstorms that are blowing through the base, a lot of people who work at the base end up being killed, except obviously the Kate Beckinsale character. And that's pretty obvious. So a killer's running on the loose at the scientific base, and it turns out that he's killing all the people on the base because he doesn't want anybody to find out that there's a missing plane out in the middle of the Antarctica with all this jewelry and gold. Whiteout definitely isn't one of the worst movies I've ever seen, but I can say that I thought it was very unoriginal and very predictable. In some scenes, I thought the dialogue was really corny and really cliched. Also, the fact that there's a killer on the loose in the movie was very predictable. I pretty much knew at the end of the movie what was going to happen. So on, that, on those facts, I'm going to give Wyatt out two stars.